Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, petrolets around the globe, welcome back to another auction house guide video on what cars are selling for millions of credits on the auction house. So without further ado, let's see what cars have gone up and down in value. Cue intro, yeah yeah. <laughs> Our first car of the day is the Ford Hoonigan RS2000. Now this thing is currently sitting at just over 10 million credits and has a starting price of 9.123 million credits. Get it gone boys, easy investment, easy profit. Maybe next up boys we've got a great investment and if you watched my last guide you would have bought at least four of these and now you're reaping the rewards. Next up we've got the brand new Toyota GT86 and guess how much this is going for. A cool 15.375 million credits and has a starting price of 13.987. <laughs> Boom, that's one gone. Do as I do boys, this is a quick 30 million credit profit. That's one gone. Now we move on to the second one. Bye-bye. Uh, A cool 30 million. Why not? Right, boys. I'll see you with the next car. Yeah, yeah. Nissan Fairlady Z 1994 plate. I do not have one of these. I sold it. But it's currently sitting at 12.294 million credits and has a lowest starting price of 6.658 million credits, boys. Get this gone. Oh, it's actually a $15 million car, to be fair. That's a buyout price of 15 there. If you have one of these, boys, get it gone, because this price will depreciate, because, as you can see right now, there is tons of them. That price is surely going to come down in the next couple of days. So if you're watching this on the 10th of November, 2020, get it gone today, boys. Yeah, yeah. Moving on. So we've got the Ferrari 812 Superfast, a staple car that is very hard to get, to be fair. It's currently sitting at a comfortable price of 20 million credits. And this guy's put it on the lowest reserve price of 300k. Oh, you idiot, mate. But that's not the point. 20 million credit car. If you have it, boys, keep a hold of it. Might as well. It's a great, inv great investment car, to say. But mm, there is quite a lot of them in the auction house. I could see this price depreciating in a couple more weeks if this carries on in this pattern. But mm, we'll have to see. Moving on. If you've got a Ferrari 812 super fast... Chances of you getting it sold, e not too sure. Keep a hold of it. Keep a hold of it, boys. It's a very rare car. Next up, BMW. And we've got two M3s selling for huh, quite a bit of pennies. Quite a bit of pennies. Do you want to see how much they're going for? Currently sitting at an M3 GTR, 7.383 million with the lowest starting price of... Probably just under that, I'd say. Yeah, 6.717. And then moving up, we've got the M3 2005. Currently sitting at 6.218 million credits, highest buyout price, and a starting reserve price of, probably just under that, yeah, 5.659. So yeah, if you have an M3 or an M3 GTR, get them sold, boys. Big profit. Moving on. Honda, we've got the Prelude SI. Now, I bought this for 5 million credits, and it's now worth 12.272 million. And I'm going to get you gone. That is a cheeky little bit of profit. Boom. Get that sold. Honda Prelude, 12.272 million. If you have one, boys, get it gone. Great investment. Moving on to Lexus, we've got the brand new RCF, currently sitting at 12 million credits. But there's a twist on this one, boys. This car is not coming back next week, unlike the ICF that got made available. So my advice is keep a hold of this car, the RCF, the fat one, because it will be a $20 million car in a couple more weeks. The price is appreciating weekly. So give it another two to three to four weeks on this car. Do not sell it yet. You're selling it at a loss. It will be 15 to 20 million credits easily soon. Very exclusive car, hard to find. Plus its rival, the ICF, is coming back next week. So that price will depreciate even lower. And this price will go up, boys. Trust me on that. Do not sell this for 12 million. Keep a hold of it. Moving on. Depreciation in price in the Mercedes AMG GT4-door coupe. Now, I've watched this car gone from 20 million 
down to 400k now back up to 8.192 million and that's took about six months cannot lie to you hmm do we sell it will it go up in price i think it will so personally i'm going to hold on to it but if you'd like to sell yours it is currently sitting at big cheddar prices of 8.192 million and a starting price of exactly the same up to you boys but my advice to you is keep a hold of it the price is on the move it's going up which we love so keep a hold of it boys moving on odd and this time we've got the hashtag 5 escort 1977 plate currently sitting at 8.27 million and the lowest reserve price of well 7 million as it looks like i personally don't have one of these but i know it's selling for big cheddar big cheddar so if you've got one of these boys try get it gone for a cool 8 million credits moving on Ford theme and we've got the Ford Mustang RTR Spec 5 now this car you can always count on for being over 10 million credits when you sell it I've sold about four of them for 10 mil in the past and it is currently sitting at you guessed it 10.120 million if you have one of these boys you can either keep it and hope for appreciation but right now that is a cool 10 million credit profit up to you there's the price my advice is go and sell this car it's always getting available on the Forza Horizon shop and I won't be surprised if it gets introduced into the new backstage pass. So, if you want to make a quick, cool 10 million credits, go do that. Moving on. On our list, boys, we've got the Hot Wheels Mustang. Now, I am sad to report this thing has had a 2 million depreciation hit. It was once selling, well, for 12 point something million. It's now selling for 10.339 million. And there's a lot of reasons why this is. The marketplace could be getting flooded with them, which evidently brings the prices lower. But... A 2 million hit on a car that's worth over 10 million credits is not that much difference, to be fair. But this is the price for the Hot Wheels Mustang. My advice is to you is to keep a hold of it, because this car's rare, and it will go back up in price to 12 to 15 million in time, of course. But it has had a depreciation hit. It is something to take notice of and beware. So if you'd like to sell this car for a quick cool 10 million credits, get it gone. Mercury Cougar Eliminator, currently sitting at 20 million credits, the highest price on the game. If you've got one of these sitting around in your garage, the C-Class car that nobody drives, get it gone, boys. I just tried to bid on these. This guy just bought one, two, and three. So that's two for that 60 million he just spent on a car that he can't even make a profit on because he just bought it for 20 million credits like an idiot. Don't be that guy. But anyway, boys, if you've got one there, get it gone, boys. That's a cool 20 million profit for you. Last but certainly not least, boys, we've got the Toyota Terreno. Now, this thing is currently sitting at 12.874 million credits. Now, my advice to you is to get this car sold, because as you can see already, there is a lot on the auction house right now, just infinite scrolling. I believe that this price will drop in the next couple of days, even weeks. So if you've got one of these laying around, try and get it sold for 12 million credits. But that concludes this video there, and I hope you enjoyed. If you did, you don't have to leave a like, and you don't have to subscribe. Just have a good rest of your day. Hope you and your family are well, and I'll catch you in the next one. Oh, and hey, I hope you enjoy these designs, and if you do... <laughs> Make sure you go download them because they are beautiful and I'll catch you in the next one. Yeah, yeah